What's going on, buddy? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're gonna to be doing a vlog style type video because I'm gonna go see Dune in New York. I'm flying to New York for the very first time to see Dune there, my most anticipated film the entire year, and as well as attend the New York Film Festival and just explore New York for less than 36 hours. But this video is gonna be titled Less Than 24 Hours because pretty much that's the amount of time I will actually be in New York City. There's a lot of flying, there's a lot of traveling. And then when I get there, it's gonna be a blast. So guys, come along for my journey. And make sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you guys are new here, as well as comment down below. Without further ado, let's get started right now. We are here in New York City, guys. This is exciting because, of course, this is my adventure to see Dune. I'm literally gonna be here for less than 24 hours. This is my awesome room. Let's kind of take a little bit of a room tour. So obviously, here's the mirror. Here's my fit, Munchkins Boutique. Check that out, director of photography. Go get your own shirt, I absolutely love it. Here's the bathroom. Pretty small, but it's whatever. I'll make it work, I'll make it work. And of course, let's show the room. Not too bad, not too bad. Bedroom, some cool artwork. TV, some of my just random stuff that I have all right side there. All this, and I was, you know, when I walked up, I was like, I'll show you guys the outside of this, but I was like, okay, well, I gotta get an awesome view, right? There's so many floors. Uh, this is my view. It's not terrible. It's not great, though. Um, I was hoping for a little bit more, but, of course, let me set you guys down for a second. All right, I think it'll stay. We're gonna go have some fun. We're gonna go to Venture before we wait in line to see Dune. And then afterwards, who knows what we're gonna do. There's so many possibilities in New York City. I definitely wanna see Times Square. Definitely wanna get some pizza out here. And I just wanna have some fun, maybe run into some other YouTubers or other critics that I know out here. And I'm just ready to have some, a blast, guys. And of course, my Dune reaction will be throughout this vlog. Once I do see it, I'm really, really excited. It's coming up less than a couple hours now. We're hitting it. And then we're gonna head home tomorrow. We're gonna be exhausted, but it's gonna be a blast. So let's move on. Everybody, we are done. We just got done seeing Dune and it is fantastic. It exceeded all my expectations in every sort of way. And I will have a full review up on the channel. It's probably even going up before the vlog actually goes up, which is what you're watching right now. But just to kind of show, was it worth me to fly for less than 24 hours to New York to go see Dune early? Absolutely, yes. And I need to see this movie again because there's so much that happens in it. And the fact that I was exhausted and still enthralled throughout the entire movie to the point where the second the movie ended, I wanted to scream out loud, no, because I wanted it to keep going. It ends in a way where you are craving part two and it is a phenomenal piece of cinematic, it's a cinematic treasure in other shapes and form. Uh, the performances across the board are stellar. Timothy Chalamet is amazing. Jason Momoa was amazing. Um, I really liked his performance in here and the action vibes that Denis Villeneuve was able to do with him. Rebecca Ferguson might have stolen the entire show. Oscar Isaac, every single person here is phenomenal in their performances and really much brings the book to life. But again, the true star of this is Denis Villeneuve. This is his passion project that he's wanted to do since he was a kid, since he had read the book at 14 years old. And you can fully tell this. I haven't felt this way watching a movie since I probably watched A New Hope or Lord of the Rings for the very first time when it took me to a world 
like that. You don't see that too often in movies nowadays. And the fact that Dune was able to excel and give me that and more was, again, just a cinematic treasure because that's exactly what Dune is. It's a cinematic treasure that's beautiful from every single piece and frame, and Hans Zimmer's score is phenomenal. This is a technical achievement, but overall, it's a movie that all of you guys have to go see in theaters. If you can, if you can't, and you have to watch it at HBO Max, that is totally fine. Support this movie in the best way possible. This is truly a game changer, and I freaking loved it. And again, if I was disappointed, I would have said it because I spent a lot of money to come here and it was totally worth it. So let's continue our journey. Let's have a little bit more fun in New York. Let's see what we can get into trouble in, but just in general, I love to Dune. It's perfect. That is it for my New York Film Festival trip. 24 hours to see Dune. I've literally been in New York for less than 24 hours and I will be flying out early tomorrow morning and I will not have time to do anything else to this. You guys saw me walk through Times Square. You guys saw me do a lot more walking. I did 18,000 steps today to see a lot of cool things and I got to see Dune. I did this whole entire trip so I could see Dune so we can have some fun and I can do some more vlogging. If you guys enjoy vlogs like this, let me know. Maybe I'll start doing more and kind of coming up with new segments that I can possibly do. I'm having fun with my brand new camera that I got for it and you know, just, you know what to do. Hit that like and subscribe button if you guys are new here and you enjoy movie content over here on a daily basis. That's what I do. I'm the movie guy, I'm a movie critic and I love being able to do this. So thank you once again guys for clicking on this because it shows you all the best. Hit the like and subscribe button, comment down below your guys' thoughts. How excited are you for Dune? And go watch my Dune review because that should be up as of right now. That's what I was planning to do before posting this and I'm still planning on doing that right now but I had a blast I'm gonna miss New York this was such a lively lively town and I hope next time maybe I can bring my girlfriend because she would absolutely have loved it here so thank you once again guys for all the support and until next time stay classy